the lineup, ready to do a pass. If it runs at 9.40, I'll be happy and we'll hit the road. the alternator um, maybe there's it's a tiny bit out I mean it didn't throw the belt but uh, we we're just having a look at kind of the bonnet before we hit the road make sure everything was happy and just noticed it I mean it would have done the drive no problem but we'd rather change it now know it's good we'd rather do it here than be doing anything on the side of the road we've got our map of where we're going to go we've handed in our time card so we handed in a, a 973 at 142.8 mile an hour you do it here, if you break in a link, well, you can get help. When you're out on the road, you've got limited help. Sort of got when the tune went in the in the in the cells we've never been before, so yeah, just went um, ridiculously rich and yeah, but all good. We we just pulled a heap of fuel out of it, so we should see and see better result this time. Yeah, I probably left the line with what, not enough power, and then by the time it did come in, it, it just busted the tyres loose at about 100 feet. So ready for another one. So, definitely wasn't a planned half track shut off you know we were looking to make one run and get on the highway but uh, as with everyone on drag week you know nothing goes perfectly every run um, we've got a boost creep issue and I think it's the way I've built my exhaust manifolding to the wastegates uh, so yeah basically we got down there and, and uh, the safety shut off uh, on the boost controller basically um, when it saw 28 pounds it killed the ignition Whatever ET slip we get next is gonna have to do because I'm eager to get on the highway. The tank. Left it a bit late, couldn't get them, so I had to wait till the shop opened up. We went down to the, what was that speed shop called? Winner Circle. Got all the parts. Just got to hook up these to the oil pan, and that's it. And fix the accumulator.
we had pulley problems yesterday, belts flying off, then the cooler hose were blowing off this morning and the computer wouldn't talk to the laptop and it's all been going on today. So Steve O's gonna come home now. It's go time. I think Bailey's come up to get a taste of Steve O. Let's go interview him, come on. You follow me around or something? Yep. You want a piece of Steve O? Yeah, I'm afraid of it. Uh, get after it. You want a dollar on it? Dollar on which part? Hey, Are you making it to the end? So as you can see, the Aussies back here behind me are in the stage lanes, just trying to get that last run today. Day one, 2017 Drag Week, Cordova, Illinois. They're feverishly working on that. They had them a little, uh, uh, somebody was looking after them just a minute ago, gave them a little extra time down there checking the top end of the racetrack. Track looks clear. We got two cars in the water box, and two cars do a, do a burnout. If the Aussies aren't suited and ready, hood on, peeing in, ready to go. They're not going to make the last run, day one, drag week. Wow, Bonnie Griffith sent it out. It's ready now. I'm talking about some minutes, Hey, 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 we're done. We're done. Come on, man. I know. I know. It's just fair for everybody. I needed you in the water box right behind those cars, just like we've been pulling. Someone tell us. I told you. I sat here and told him all day. Come get him in the water box. Come on, brother. Nope. We're done. Go, that is 